Hi, so in this video I'll be talking about hypertensive crisis, what is it, the symptoms of hypertensive crisis, and how we can go about treating it. Hypertensive crisis occurs when there is a drug combination with monoamine oxidase inhibitors along with foods containing tyramine or TCAs or certain medications which I'll cover in this video. Hypertensive crisis is life-threatening, so this is medical emergency, and when patients are combined with TCAs or MAOIs, drug combinations, you want to remember that you want to wait two weeks for the washout period before switching between the two classes of medications. Hi just like the name says, hypertensive crisis, there is going to be an increase in blood pressure and increase in heart rate. Hypertensive crisis can also cause death when MAOI inhibitors are combined with certain medications. So let's see what those certain medications are. These are your asthma medications, St. John's wort, decongestions, meperdine, atypical antipsychotics, your TCAs, L-tryptophan, stimulants, and other sympathomimetics. When monoamine oxidase and foods containing tyramine are taken, there is hypertensive, there is going to be hypertensive crisis. What are those foods? These are your H or fermented beverages, smoked, cured meats, ripe bananas, soy products, or avocados. So these are the foods that you want to tell the mono, uh, tell the patients who are taking monoamine oxidase inhibitors not to take along with their medications. Because, once again, this is going to cause hypertensive crisis. Okay, symptoms of hypertensive crisis, just like the name says, hypertensive. There's going to be an increase in blood pressure, increase in heart rate. The patient's going to be complaining about palpitations. There's going to be an increase in temperature. They're having facial flushing, sudden explosive headache, pupillary dilation, and they're sweating. How do we go about treating the hypertensive crisis? Well, you're discontinuing the monoamine oxidase inhibitor or the triggering factor. This is when you are giving the patient phentolamine. Why? Because it blocks the norepinephrine. It binds to the norepinephrine receptor site and blocks the norepinephrine. If they're symptomatic for temperature, you're also going to treat the fever. So let's recap. Hypertensive crisis is caused when monoamine oxidase inhibitors are in combination with foods containing tyramine, TCAs, or certain medications. The symptoms of hypertensive crisis are going to be your increase in blood pressure, increase in heart rate, and increase in temperature. This is where the patient's having facial flushing, sudden explosive headaches, pupillary dilation. How do we treat it? Phentolamine. You got it. You're discontinuing the monoamine oxidase inhibitor or the triggering factor and you're going to give this patient phentolamine. All right, sounds like you got it. If not, please watch the video again. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please click like and subscribe to the channel. I hope you can share it with someone who can benefit this knowledge on hypertensive crisis. Thank you. Bye-bye.